Hello, cult members, and welcome to Pop Culture Cult. I'm Sean. I'm Janice. And welcome to our new series called Now We Know, where we go back and watch old tra- trailers and trailers and, tra- and trailers and see what they tell us and if they hold up and everything. And we're in the end part of phase three of the MCU, and now we're going to do Captain Marvel. Actually, it's really funny because it's called Marvel's. Marvel Studios, Captain Marvel, 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 of Marvel, <laughs> Malkovich, 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 Malkovich. Uh, I I have found that I keep going back to this one more and more, even though I didn't. It's not really in my top five or ten or whatever, but I keep going back to it. It's nineties, so right, right in my wheelhouse. So right, yeah, I, uh, you know, yeah, it's probably not in my top ten, and I can't really say why say why but yeah i, I like it a yeah. lot and i love you know i mean we both love brie larson and i yeah. love that they i guess we're going to talk about it now i love that they go back and um kind of tie up some loose ends loose you know ends how, and stuff how and everything. um fury gets his eye yeah yeah and eye patch yeah. And, and stuff but yeah i don't can't yeah. put my finger on why yeah, it, may, it might be like maybe 10 or it's nine. hard when, when there's 24 movies or whatever and they're yeah. all really good yeah and so it's hard to like to sit there and like you, now you're getting really nitpicky and everything yeah. we're gonna do our breakdown of the mcu now uh <laughs> but uh i'm interested to see what this trailer shows us because uh like i said i've gone back and rewatched this one a bunch of times so i'm interested to, sh- to see if they show us anything right and knowing that this is set in the 90s before we get to end game and all that uh, kind of jazz, jazz so i'm interested to see what they show us in this trailer so here we go here is Marvel Studios Captain Marvel of Marvel. Uh, Marvel. Trailer, <laughs> trailer Marvel, reaction. Marvel of 2 tra- Marvel. Of, of reaction of trailers. <laughs> Marvel. And go. Are we crashing again? Yep. Ow. Into a blockbuster. Just right. It's going to be the 90s. <laughs> is a universal language. I know a renegade soldier when I see one. Never occurred to me that one might come from above. Let's change colors. Big car chase. Truth be told, I was ready to hang it up till I met you today. Da! So you're not from <laughs> Both eyes. It's hard to explain. I keep having these memories. I see flashes. I think I had a life here. But I can't tell if it's real. Just hanging around. Idea what threats are out there. And the internet explodes. We need you. I'm not what you think I am. (laughs) True. That was a good trailer. It is a good trailer. Uh, and the idea of, uh, so at the time, everyone compl- everybody complained about her suit being the wrong color. Everybody complained about her punching the old lady. Right. And, um, and a lot of people discussed her turning into a hero. Like that was the big discussion. The, the, the word. The wording her. or whatever. Her, it was her on the middle of the screen and then it changed into a hero. And that was the main discussion because fascist white guys have have nothing else better to do. <laughs> sexist. Sex, sexist. Sexist too. Um, but that was the big three topics. Oh, by the way, this trailer is awesome. Yeah. Yeah. You get to see Coulson and Fury both de-aged. De-aged, yeah. Um, which still holds up. I mean, it was only Last a year, year ago. Yeah, yeah. So not um, – you get to see 
her kind of becoming Captain Marvel yeah. just in the trailer, yeah. right? You see stuff from when she was a kid and from when she was in basic training yeah. and yeah. being yeah. a pilot and then her the getting the powers and... her, her absorbing the powers. Yeah. But I like the misdirection of like them talking about like trying to figure out who she is or how or or what her powers are and she's hanging upside down when she's getting when, after she's been kidnapped by the scroll you right know? right so it's but i had yeah. like i i don't feel like this trailer told me anything about the actual movie i mean i liked all of it yeah, but yeah. you would not glean the actual story from any of that yeah absolutely Abs I, this is more of let's introduce the character of Captain Marvel yeah. to because this is the first trailer, and so okay. the, uh, this was more of an introduction of Captain Marvel because she, although beloved by the comic book people Community. and 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 the com I don't want to call them nerds but they're comic book nerds um, <laughs> beloved by the comic book nerds and her, all of her different iterations she's had over the years, the mass of people don't re didn't really know who she was. Right. And so here's who this person is. Oh, by the way, it's being played by Brie Larson, yep. who is amazing, by the way. Yep. We we talked about it earlier about how much we both love her. And a lot of um, – and some people complained about how she handled stuff because she was – very much in people's face like yeah i'm playing a superhero yep you know <laughs> and that's her and if you've ever seen yeah. her do stuff not you know just regular stuff that's her yeah and you know sadly you've got to be like as an actor trying out for this position this is this role this is something that you have to be prepared for before you ever step in to yeah. to yeah, to absolutely. try out for the role because the internet is not going to be kind to you because you're the first full on main character female um, action hero uh, uh, getting her own movie now right. everyone says that it should have been Black Widow and probably in the grand scheme of things it probably should have been Black Widow who got her first standalone superhero movie um, it makes if you understand the culture how things evolved it it makes sense how it kind of played out and everything well but... and they needed her for end game right they needed marvel captain marvel captain for marvel end, yeah, for to Endgame. be yeah. to be there and um i mean i like scarlett johansson and i really like her as um black widow but her standalone movies action movies i'm thinking of that anime one yeah the have, ghost in the shell i don't ghost think that was shell. necessarily her fault but right but, yeah. but uh, that's kind of some baggage you bring with yeah, you yeah, and i'm looking forward to black widow apparently we're going to talk about all, all the other stuff that's going <laughs> on but with this i i really appreciate that they they had the misdirect with jude law everybody yeah. thought he was gonna be marvell and i like the misdirect they actually kind of show him as the kree soldier like trying to like hey this is going to be marvel look 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 over here yep. and not even you don't even see actual marvel right it, it, uh annette benning annette benning in this trailer at all now yeah. i i know you do and i think it's the third trailer they're walking out of the hangar, hangar or, whatever. or whatever yeah but uh, I, I, the way they set everything up in this trailer with just the introduction of here here's who this character is this is kind of and this is Brie Larson who's playing her and how important, like, like a lot of people took the trailer as, you know, girls standing up for themselves. But this was more about the character of Carol Danvers standing up for herself and taking her power. But people didn't understand that when it came out, like they just it took it matter. as a political. It doesn't matter. I, I'm, I'm not. I'm oh, not my just... God. A girl stood up and said. I'm a badass. And she didn't smile the entire trailer. Calm and she down. kept she kept clenching her hand in her fist like she's gonna pick up a fight. But it was Carol Danvers learning who she really was as Captain Marvel, which is what they show in the trailer and everybody took it a different way. And and it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Because unless you're a woman, shut up. <laughs> I was going to use the F word, but I'll save it because you don't know. Right, right. 
and you I just know. I just felt like they did a really good job with this yeah, trailer, I really like especially this going back and after watching everything that happens in Captain Marvel and Endgame and yep. where you know where it ended up going and stuff. And I'm super excited about what they're gonna do in the second one, right? And we didn't even, they didn't even show the scrolls in this trailer. Yeah, like, like that's a huge part of what's right. going on in the future. So yeah, I was just oh. We're gonna go watch Captain Marvel now. See, I told you. I don't know why it's not one of the movies we keep. Yeah, I, we keep going back to it. Maybe we need to do a uh, rate all of the Marvel movies Marvel up till now. Something like that. Yeah. From, from twenty five, right? Twenty five to one. Twenty four to one. Twenty four to one. So yeah, maybe we should do that. I like those odds. Let <laughs> us know what you thought of this trailer, our reaction to it, and the movie overall in the comments down below. Like this video, of course. Subscribe to the channel while you're here and hit the bell for notifications. And follow us on all the social media stuff, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that stuff. All those links are in the description down below. And if we don't see you, cult members, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.